Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to create this rainbow brush in the app HighPaint. So let's get started. First, I'm opening the HighPaint app and here I'm going to create a screen size canvas. Now, this is the clear layer and here I'm going to use the basic uh, brush that is already provided by the app. So this is the brush. This is ballpoint brush. So I'm using this ballpoint pen brush to create my own 3D brush. So what I have to do is copy this brush. Then go to the folder or the, uh, you know, the group that uh, where you want to create your brush and paste that brush now so to hide this layer I'm going to create the shape for my own brush so in the new layer just by hiding the uh, layer already we have I'm going to draw the circle um, it has only outline the inside of that circle is empty so just create the circle like this adjust the uh, you know circle thickness or uh, the size of the brush as you require and just make it build uh, to the size of the canvas now i'm going to save this as png for creating png just hit the uh, you know switch off the background layer and save that as png now just hide that layer we don't need that any anymore because already we have saved it now go to the brush that we have pasted already now i'm going to rename this brush as a rainbow brush because having a uh, same name for two brush will you know make us confused so now go to that brush settings go to shape and here is the shape that is used for this brush now click on that click on the plus symbol and choose the shape that you created now now just click on this like this now if we use the brush it looks same as before no variations so I will show you how to create that rainbow brush now. Now increase the spacing as you require. Check how much spacing you want between each element. So just by adjusting and checking out you will know the difference. So you have to do it continuously till you get the required brush. Now go to this dynamics and here Change the color, uh, you know, jitter hue. Now, by changing the hue value to, I mean, increasing the hue value, you will get the brush with almost all the colors. If you keep the hue value to maximum 100%, you will get all the colors. Yeah, like this. It's like, you know, rainbow of all the colors. Now, you can adjust the number of colors you want uh, you know by changing the hue value and also you can change the brightness uh, all those things using the saturation uh, luminosity and you know all those dark details now what else we can change is uh, no more you know not much things for this if you change the softness, you will get something like this. If you want that kind of brush, you can use otherwise. Keep the softnesses and you know roundness. Everything is same as before. So we don't want this as well. So I'm changing the roundness as same as before. Now the font. No, we don't need any other changes than uh, other than these. You no know, changing space. Uh, size spacing between the elements and the hue value that are the two main things we need here also by changing the luminosity darkness saturation we will get the 
uh, color variations in the same brush. So you can see as I change these values, I'll get entirely different color variations. So it's up to you how you want your brush to be. So I like this one. I'm just going to keep the lumos the to the maximum, and yeah, this is what I want. So now I'm okay with the changes. So here you can see if I change to the hand the percentage, I will get the brush like this, and I like this one. So this is going to be the final brush, and here. I show you how to you know use this brush for example if you want to create a yeah, word um, you know text art free text something like that then do this like this so yeah we got the new brush rainbow brush and you can create so many different things with that if you like this tutorial uh, subscribe to my channel and check out all the high paint uh, tutorials also I upload videos in IBS Paintex and Infinite Painter check out that as well hope you like this tutorial thank you for watching subscribe to my channel